The process of replacing the timing chain in the Skyactiv G engine is the same as other timing chains that you replaced before. However, there are a few points I would like you to note. First of all, the crankshaft pulley is keyed. If you recall, the previous Mazda engines were not. This is a huge improvement. Compressing the timing chain tensioner plunger into the tensioner to remove the timing chain is the same as other tensioner removal procedures. Just use a wire with an approximate diameter of 1.5 millimeters or drill bit to hold the plunger in the tensioner. Replace the timing chain tensioner in reverse order. Then you're able to remove the tensioner, chain guide, and the timing chain. Now, as you replace the old timing chain with a new one, alignment is very important. First, make sure the crankshaft keyway is facing up or 90 degrees from the bottom of the block. Rotate the exhaust camshaft so that the timing marks on the cam sprocket align with the top of the head. As you can see, these two marks are parallel with the cylinder head upper surface. Make sure the third timing mark on the sprocket is pointing up, but not perfectly 90 degrees to the cylinder head upper surface. Then on the intake cam, this timing mark needs to be parallel to the cylinder head upper surface and aligned with the timing mark on the exhaust cam sprocket. Also, there is a pin on this sprocket that must point up about 90 degrees from the cylinder head upper surface. Remember, this pin will not be positioned exactly at 90 degrees. And that's okay. You'll see why in a little bit. Now, install the new timing chain. It's best to start the installation on the bottom with the crankshaft. Just make sure the key stays pointing straight up. Place the timing chain on the crank with the yellow link lined up with the mark on the crankshaft sprocket. Then position the two orange links on each mark of the cam sprockets. You have properly installed the timing chain when all the timing marks are aligned and all the colored links align with their marks on the sprockets. When you have properly installed the timing chain, then you may continue to reattach the rest of the Skyactiv-G engine components.